Welcome back. This is Nordic Country episode 12. And today we got a pretty a pretty a pretty busy day. Can't speak as usual. But we got to mow the grass, get some silage, harvest field 28, do some straw pelleting, fertilize the grass field and anything else that comes up. We should probably check on the sheep let's see how are they doing they still have full oh yeah cause this is sitting here so yeah their food is full they need cleaned up a little bit and their water is good but it says there's no wool why does it say there's no wool oh alright I was gonna say there should have been wool in there Hopefully it's still producing, right? Yeah. Productivity is up. So yeah, I like sheep. They're low maintenance. We haven't even really had to take care of them much. And they make us decent money. So. What I'm going to do. I'm going to probably start wind drawing. I'm trying to think. There's really nothing else for me to do. Let me check and see how this field is so that's growing that's growing that's growing that's growing harvesting that right now and then this will be the next field and getting some straw pellets off of it and that has grass in it it's not really that big of a grass field but we'll probably do some root crops in it as well I don't know. I would like to buy this food. Yeah, guys, we own a good bit of land. Yeah, I might. I don't know. I really want to get this field, but that won't be anytime soon. We need to get some bigger equipment before we get a field that big. So, yeah, maybe we'll start saving up to get some bigger equipment because we got a decent amount of land. What do we got? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six fields. So I think we're <clears throat> doing all right on fields. We got a decent sized one right here. And we could also always um, plant a different crop in here. We don't have to keep doing grass in here. Because we got plenty of hay, straw, grass. Plenty of grass for the sheep. So we don't really need to keep doing hay. But it would be nice to get that silage money or grass. Yeah, I really can't speak right now, guys. I'm sorry. Today's been kind of an off day for me. But we'll go ahead. That guy's really zooming. Or at least it looked like it from back there. But yeah, we'll go ahead and start wind drawing this. I would like to get a bigger wind drawer. That would be nice. But I think first thing we'll get is like a bigger cedar. And then we need to start doing some like corn or something. Because we got the planter and we hardly ever used it. We did some sunflower. But I think I want to start doing some corn. I think we'll start alternating. Like one time it'll be soybean. One time it'll be corn. And just keep going back and forth. And every once in a while, instead of soybeans, we'll do um, a crop that produces straw. So we can make some money off of straw pelleting if we get a decent amount. It all depends on how much we're going to be getting off of it. So if we do make a good amount off of it, then we'll probably do a lot more straw crops. But if we don't, then... We probably won't do a lot more straw crops. Because if we like stop doing canola and stuff. And just did all like wheat, oat, barley. We would get a ton of liters of stuff. Because it's a high liter crop. Plus we could make a decent amount of money. Off the straw pellets. So it would be. I guess a smarter thing to do really. Because we're trying to grow this. Um, farm up real quick. We're well, not quick, but 
as quick as possible because we do want to get this um, wrapped up before Farming Simulator 22 comes out. And I'd like to do probably 60 episodes in this series. I want to get a massive farm going. So yeah, it would be nice to grow it up kind of quick, but not too, too quick. That guy's really rolling, though. But yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and finish up this and then I'll bring you guys back in once it's time to pick it all up. And hopefully by then our field will be ready to harvest. So I will see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, I changed my mind. I'm going to go ahead and let a worker work on that. And we're just going to go ahead and start picking up some grass a while. Just to kind of get three done, three things done at the same time. We'll get it picked up, mowed, and windrowed all at the same time. We might have to stop the windrower because the mower. I don't know if he'll mow enough for it to windrow. We'll have to find out. But yeah, we're getting this. Get this all picked up. To go in here and start my. A stopwatch so I know how long we're recording for we're not gonna get as much as last time but we still have that little bit left in the silo so we should get a decent amount Last time it was two mows and the one mow didn't have fertilizer put down, so I think we should get around like we got 250 last time, so we should probably get around like close to 250, honestly, or not 250, like 180 maybe. We'll just have to see how it goes. I don't know though, it don't seem like we're going to get that much. Can I finish this row? Alright, I'm going to just... Alright, let's go ahead and get this dumped into the bunker silo. Last time we had this thing filled up so full it was crazy. I'm try to get over as close as possible to the edge. That helper D is blocked. Who's helper D? I guess they unblocked themselves. I don't know. Go ahead and get this little bit picked up. Oh, uh, let me grab this little bit right here. grab this little bit down here that we missed. We want to try to get all of it off the field. Are they really blocked? No. What I'm going to do though, I'm going to go ahead and stop this guy real quick. Just stop him for a second. Wait for a little bit more to get mowed because honestly 
this is going to take a while to pick it all up so we don't even need to keep going we can let that pretty much get completely mowed and then start it again and we'll still be fine cruise control down to about 18 16 will work too yeah, I think we can bump it up we'll go 17 I don't know guys, you might only get like 120,000 off of this food. No, it's not completely full, but it's only like 90 liters away from being full, so we'll just dump it. Go ahead and run this over a little bit, get it compacted down. It's easier to compact it with a full trailer. So I like to dump it and then drive over it and then dump it and drive over it. Actually, what we're going to do, we'll turn on the help menu. over here and turn that on so we can see how far compacted we got it oh, this is way quicker than trying to do it with just a tractor and an empty trailer way quicker Try to get over here kind of farther. Yeah, it works a lot better if you um, dump it all out slowly. So then it's easier to compact it all down. And you can drive on it better unless instead of like just dumping big piles. It makes it easier. But yeah, I'll get um, some more of this finished up and then I'll bring you guys back in a little bit later All right guys, I got all of it up. We got a hundred and thirty five thousand liters So we'll go ahead and start from burn it fermenting that And our field still isn't ready to harvest so we'll just go ahead and get this Put back in we'll keep this out because we'll need it to cart But we'll get this put back away and we will start fertilizing the field actually that's what we need to do we'll just use this to cart it'll work but what we gotta do let's shut that off that has almost 10 hours on it already that's crazy how many hours does this have on it? Nine. Jeez. Got a lot of hours. I wonder how much the mess he has. We just got it. 
I would say less than five. Oh wow, it has only well, has one point two hours on it. Now I gotta remember which one's lime and which one's fertilizer. I think the one right here is fertilizer. Yeah. So difficult to back them trailers up with the swivel axles. We'll go ahead and get him started right here. And then I'll probably bring you guys back in once it's time to do this harvest. It should be pretty soon. We're going to need to get them fields over there fertilized. Let me write that down. What are the field numbers? Turn that off and go over here so it's 39 and 38 need for it 39 and 38 and our grass food alright our, our no number over here we'll just make that grass grass too Need to get that fertilized, but yeah, I'll bring you guys back in once. Where's that? Once this is ready, it's almost ready. So yeah, that'll be the plan. I'll see you guys when this is ready to harvest. All right, guys. So it looks like our field is ready to harvest. I'm working on a fertilizing contract up here. I think it's nine thousand. Yeah, nine thousand five hundred for that. So that'll give us a nice little bit of money. But I'm going to hop down here into the harvester. Out. Oh, wrong button. And we will get to harvesting. So I brought down all the equipment. Got it all ready. Why is it not giving me a straw swath? There we go. I was about to be mad. I didn't know that you could turn it on and off on this. But we're going to use the grain cart for carting the wheat. And then we'll use this for the pellets. So we're going to go ahead and just hop in here and start pelleting. We should get a decent amount. I think oh, it automatically shut off because of how much it was. So yeah, we'll get this because this is going to take forever to do. It's only on four miles per hour. I thought it went six. Does it need repaired? That doesn't need repaired and let's check out the pelleter. That doesn't need repaired either. Maybe it goes slower for straw, I don't know. I guess so. So yeah, now it's really gonna take long because before for grass it went six miles per hour and now for this it's going four miles per hour. We got a decent sized field here to do. It looks like we're going to get a lot of straw pellets off of this. Because like off of a whole grass field, I think we got like three unloads maybe. So like 30,000, 20 to 30,000 pellets. And off of just one pass, we're already at about 50, 50%. 50 we're not even done with this pass, so... We should get a decent amount. Uh, yeah, I can tell this episode is going to take a while to create because it's going to take forever to get all this turned into pallets. But we should make a load of money. We will probably make a ton of money off of this. Because I think the straw... Let me check here. I think the straw sells for more than the grass ones. I gotta see the logos. 
So is that the tall one or the short one? I can't really tell what that is. I think that's the short one. So isn't the short one worth more? Yeah, the short one's worth way more. Yeah, we're going to make a good chunk of money off of this. We're getting way more straw off of the fields. And we're making more money. So we should get a lot. Actually, once he gets done with that contract, he needs to come over. I figured out that our field right here is already fertilized, and our other little grass field over there is already fertilized. So we don't need to worry about that. We just need to do 39. <clears throat> but I gotta check this contract and see how completed 90%. So yeah, once he gets done with that, we're gonna have him come up here and do 39 canola should be ready next episode yeah this is going to take forever to get all this up off of the field but the money is definitely going to be worth it Let's see, we need to get this guy. And he's almost full, so it's gonna this is gonna be a lot of unloading and transporting because that'll only hold two unloads and this will only hold like two and a half unloads, so I'm gonna be doing a lot of carting back and forth. So we'll get this guy right here unloading and then we will grab the Massey and get him over there to unload. So every pass and a half he'll be full. And this guy will get like two two passes and be full. Sheesh, yeah, that's gonna be a lot. A lot of pellets and a lot of straw. I mean a lot of pellets and a lot of wheat. Let's go ahead and collect that 9,000. And he's loaded up, so let's go ahead and start making more. So, what I need to do, I need to move this guy over a little bit. I'm not even going to worry about turning it off. It's going to be a couple more seconds and we'll have to run it back down here again. See, I don't know how long I'll keep you guys in for because I do want to probably sell off the wheat at the end of the episode let's see what's the price is looking like uh, let's see what is the wheat price 600 and going up so yeah we'll probably sell off the wheat and we will sell off some of the well we'll sell off all of the straw pellets so I'll probably keep you guys in here for a little bit longer and then you'll see some pelleting once we get this field all done and probably while it's pelleting I will sell off the straw and then once all the pellets are turned into pallets I will sell them off so we should make probably I don't even know honestly I really don't know how much we're going to make it'll probably be a ton of money like we'll probably have like I don't know I want to say over definitely over a hundred thousand I don't know how far over though it could be like two hundred thousand off of all this I'm not sure might be able to upgrade some equipment which would be a good thing
I don't know what that just popped up for, but... So yeah, I'll probably go ahead and put in a little cut, get this all finished up, and then I'll bring you guys back in with the total amount of straw pellets we get off of this and the total amount of wheat. And then you'll see a little pelleting clip. I'll probably do like a couple bucket loads and then loading up some of them, depending on how well I can load them up. And then I'll do the fertilizing and we'll sell off the wheat and then we'll sell off the pellets and then that'll be the end of the episode so make sure you stay tuned to see how much money we make off all this stuff because it's going to be a boatload and i hope you guys are enjoying the content i've been busting my butt with other things and then coming back and recording episodes and throughout the night so i hope you guys are enjoying it i mean a lot if you guys would hit that subscribe button but anyways we'll go ahead and get this finished up and I'll bring you guys back in once once we're done all right we just finished up getting the straw pelleted it took like an hour I think oh yeah because we had like 2.5 hours on the tractor and now we're at 3.5 but the price for the wheat just topped off so we're gonna go ahead and take that up here and sell it where do we gotta go over here? Alright, so it's not too far. I'll just keep you guys in for the drive. Let me go down here and start my timer. Stopwatch. So we'll go up here and sell it. I think it's at 680. Yeah, 680. So that's not a bad price. We should get around 30,000 30, for it. But yeah, guys, that took forever to um, pellet all that. But we're going to make a ton of money. So far, we had four trailer loads. So that's 84,000 liters plus whatever is in the trailer right now. So it'll probably be up around 100,000 liters of straw pellets. So that's going to be like, I don't even know how much, probably over a hundred thousand dollars, but it's literally going to take probably multiple hours to get it all into pallets and to load it up on the trailer. There's going to be so many. It'll probably take like four hours, I'd say maybe longer. Probably actually it'll probably take longer than four hours If it took over four hours, I would not be surprised But let's go ahead and make this quick cash real quick In the next episode we should be able to sell our silage so we should make a decent amount of money off of that too because we got like a hundred and thirty five thousand I was I think what did I say I said thirty thousand off of it so I was pretty close yeah, let's go ahead and get this back down to the farm I'll bring you guys back in because I'm gonna take this to our farmyard unhook it and then go over and hook up to the um low low loader trailer thinks that's what we got we're gonna hook up to the other um semi trailer the flatbed so i'll bring you guys back in once we get over there all right so i went ahead and i started the fer <clears throat> excuse me i started the fertilizer spreader on that field and now so yeah we had Two, four, six, eight, eighty-four. So we got a hundred and four thousand and seven pellets. 
That is crazy. This is gonna take forever. Forever. What was I thinking? I wanted to get this all done tonight, but it's already 1 o'clock a.m., so probably, I don't know, I think I'll get it started, but I can't stay up too late, and I'm tired right now. So as you can see, we got a massive pile of pellets in here. I think, yeah, I think I'll just put this in the other, in the other bay, because that one is stuffed full. So I'm kind of curious to see how this works because we already have some hay pellets already produced. So I don't know how it's going to work. So I guess we'll just have to find out. Just sit this guy out here for now. But yeah, this is going to be crazy. I wonder if it'll just stack up like hay pellets and them onto the same pallet. Because as you see, we already have like a partial pallet created. So... I'm but yeah, look at this, guys. This is like, this is 84,000 pellets right here, plus another 20,000. I don't know if you guys ever done this massive amount before, but if you have, let me know down in the comments how long it's going to take. Think about that. The bucket does, I want to do some math on that. The bucket holds... We have a hundred, what did I say, a hundred and seven thousand, we'll do a hundred thousand divided by three thousand, it's going to be thirty three scoops, a little over thirty three scoops, so like thirty four buckets that we're going to have to fill into here. Uh, let's see what it does. So yeah, that just, where is it at, let's see, does it just stack it on top of the hay pellets? Or does it get rid of all of the pellets? So yeah, all right. Well, that's pretty cool. I was curious on how that worked. But we'll just fill this thing up until it can't hold no more. And then we'll start loading it up onto the trailer. Yeah. This may have been a big, big mistake. I guess I'll find out in like eight hours once I get done with it if it was worth it or not. I think I'll just take from right here. Well, on the plus side of things, we only have 30 buckets to go. We're just going to fill this thing up until we can't fill it up no more. There's no way he already got done fertilizing that field.
We already fertilized that whole field. Wow, that's crazy. Alright, so yeah, we got it maxed out for right now. So let's go ahead and get some of these loaded up onto the trailer. And then after I load, probably just load this one and then we'll call it an episode. Yeah, I don't feel like dealing with this tonight. I'm about to go to sleep. We will deal with this all tomorrow. Sorry guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the post notifications so you don't miss any future content. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow.